Ever wondered how we can get a heads up before an earthquake strikes? Today I'm diving into the fascinating world of earthquake early warning systems and how they might just save countless lives. Let's start with the basics. Earthquakes generate different types of waves. The first to hit are P waves or primary waves. These are the fastest kind of seismic waves, traveling through the Earth at incredible speeds. They're less destructive, but crucially, they arrive before the main event. Following closely are S waves or secondary waves. Now these are the real troublemakers. S waves move a bit slower than P waves, but they pack a much stronger punch, causing most of the shaking and damage we associate with earthquakes. So, how do early warning systems use these waves to our advantage? These systems are designed to detect the fast-moving, less destructive P waves. The moment these waves are picked up by seismic sensors, the system kicks into action. Using the data from these sensors, the system quickly calculates the earthquake's epicenter, its magnitude, and how soon the more destructive S waves will arrive. This precious information is then blasted out as an alert through various channels. Your mobile phones, TV, radio, and even public loudspeakers. Imagine this. You're sitting at home, and your phone suddenly buzzes with an alert giving you seconds, sometimes even minutes, to take cover. This short window can be crucial. It can be enough time to drop, cover, and hold on, or to evacuate vulnerable structures, reducing injuries and saving lives. Countries like Japan and Mexico have developed sophisticated early warning systems. For instance, Japan's system can provide a warning up to a minute before the earthquake hits, especially crucial in a country where seconds can mean the difference between safety and catastrophe. In conclusion, while we can't prevent earthquakes with the help of modern technology and the fast action of P waves, early warning systems give us the next best thing, time. Time to protect ourselves and our loved ones. And in many cases, that's a game changer. Thanks for tuning in and remember, staying informed is one of the best ways to stay safe. See you next time.